working on a new sustainable uh, method of collecting, which is called ranched fish. So we basically collect post larvae fish. The moment the larvae come back and settle in the reef, we grow them uh, as post larvae into uh, juveniles, and then we keep them until they are ready for sale for a couple of months. So since we've started this project, we've managed to do about 43 species uh, of fish from two different locations around the world, which is quite interesting and i'm incredibly excited to be able to show the amount of fish and the diversity that you can get with this technology it's incredibly sustainable personally i would i would feel it's a it's a really great step towards starting to still benefit people at source uh, which is incredibly important for us so these people that are now collecting wild fish if they you know start looking at different ways to do that in a more sustainable manner um, it really you know, resonates with us as a business. When we got these fish, they were maybe five times smaller than this. And we've been growing them for the past two months, I would say. So you get incredible amount of you know, different types of damsels. Uh, the reason there are so many damsels is because when you're in the ocean, 90% of what you see is damsels. So when you're collecting in this way, in which you don't really know what species you're taking, you're going to get a lot of damsels. But the idea is then to st start developing protocols to try and identify uh, not only the species that are interesting for the marine hobby, but also looking at other species that may be interesting to repopulate reefs. So one of the interesting aspects of this is that we, when we collect the fish, we collect, let's say, a thousand fish. Only about a hundred are interesting for the hobby. What do we do with the rest? So we still grow them at source with the suppliers, and then we work with uh, conservation uh, groups to repopulate reefs in various projects. So if someone has built uh, a runway on an airport or someone's built a new hotel and that damaged the reef in that location, we'll just go in and say, okay, here's 10,000 fish. My, my goal is to get to a point that we, we say, okay, for every fish we bring to the industry, we put two back in.